Hey guys, how's it going? This is Tor with Pillow Profits and today I just want to make a quick video telling you guys how we ship parcels from China all the way to the customer's destination. Okay guys, so there are two ways to ship with the Pillow Profits app. The first one is EMS and the second one is DHL Express. So with EMS, the parcels are picked up from our factory here in the south of China and they make about a one hour drive to a city called Xiamen. And once they get to Xiamen, they need to pass export customs clearance. So the export customs clearance, it varies from product to product and from country to country. And it's the factory's responsibility to supply the appropriate paperwork. Okay, so once the parcels have passed their export customs clearance, they go from Xiamen to their destination country. Although Xiamen is a pretty big city and there are lots of flights going out of Xiamen every day, sometimes, depending on the destination country, the parcel will need to wait in Xiamen until there's a flight available to go to that country. Okay, so once the parcels arrive in the destination country, they then need to pass their import customs clearance. And again, this is so much paperwork and so much documentation that the factory needs to supply. And again, it varies from product to product and from country to country. So there's a lot of paperwork. After the parcels pass the uh, import customs clearance, they can start making their way to the customer. Usually they are given to a local courier like um, Royal Mail in the UK and USPS in America. And with this courier, they'll then go to the customer's house or PO box. Okay, so the second way to ship products with Pillow Profits is to use DHL Express. So DHL Express starts off the same as EMS in which the parcels are picked up from the factory here and they uh, make a drive to Xiamen. But sometimes um, we can use DHL Shenzhen as well, which is a different city. And DHL Express is a little bit quicker than EMS. DHL Express also has a lot more cargo storage than other shipping companies, so they're able to take more packages from us than, say, other shipping companies. Another good thing about using DHL Express is that when the packages pass the import customs clearance, they are still going to be taken from DHL Express. So it's a little bit quicker and a little bit easier to pass the customs clearance because they're staying with the same courier. So then DHL Express is going to take the parcels and deliver them straight to the customer. We always have to keep up to date with the customs clearance is always changing and the documentation is always changing as well. So we always have to keep up with uh, different countries, custom laws, just to make sure that we are able to get our packages from China to the customer. Sometimes, uh, with DHL Express, we have the choice to use Xiamen or another city called Shenzhen. And Shenzhen is a lot closer to the Hong Kong border. And it's just because DHL have more cargo space. Again, once the parcels get to either Xiamen or Shenzhen, the parcels need to pass the export customs clearance. And then, once they have passed this, instead of flying to the destination country, they first fly to Hong Kong. One of the good things about flying from Hong Kong to the destination country is there are a lot more flights going from Hong Kong than there are from Xiamen to international countries. Sometimes we can encounter some problems when taking our packages from China to international countries and abroad. So sometimes, for example, in Chinese New Year and Christmas, there are a lot more packages leaving China and going to external countries. And this means that sometimes the packages can get stuck in Hong Kong or Xiamen or Shenzhen. So we are always looking for new routes to take our packages out of China. This week, we sent one of our reps down to Shenzhen and she had a meeting with DHL to discuss new ways in which we can make the whole process a lot smoother. So we are always looking for new routes. We're looking at routes in Beijing and Taiwan and just trying to find as many new routes as possible. So in the case that one route gets stuck, we can use an alternative route and get the packages out of China quicker. We have another meeting this weekend with some shipping companies. So hopefully very soon we'll have an even faster shipping time and we'll have uh, some new routes to use too. Okay, so just to recap, if the parcels are sent by EMS, they go factory, Xiamen, destination country. And if they go by DHL Express, they go factory, Xiamen or Shenzhen, and then Hong Kong, and then the destination country. It sounds longer, but it's not, because Hong Kong is only around an hour, an hour and a half from Xiamen, and like 30 minutes from Shenzhen. And um, Hong Kong have a lot more flights going out every day. And DHL Express also have a lot more uh, cargo storage on the flights. Yeah. So that's my little 
video on how we take parcels out of China to the destination country. I hope it was useful. 